quietly, you sat down, and you've been waiting for the show to start. I am so proud of you. You did exactly what we did in practice. Don't tell me about it in practice, okay? You guys promised? Are you ready? This is a big day. And we've been waiting for this day for a long time. Good afternoon. Special. It is a special and amazing day. This is one of the most special and thrilling days that I have ever had in all of my time of coming to school, not just as a student, but as an educator. This is going to be a day that we all remember and keep in our hearts forever. Now you know we've tried to keep it a secret. Some of you know, but I think you're still going to be really surprised. My name is Melanie Kiefer, and I'm the principal at Pineville Elementary School, and I am extremely honored to be here. I want to welcome all of the students, the staff, honored and honored and distinguished guests to our, to our assembly. This is the first assembly that we've had in the 2022-2023 school year. I want to welcome all honored and distinguished guests to Pineville Elementary School. And if you have not had the good fortune of being in Wyoming County every day like some of us, I want to welcome you to Waikato. Now, introduction of guests. We have with us a very distinguished guest today. We have West Virginia's First Lady, Kathy Justice. We also have Randall Reed Smith, State Curator. We also have Cynthia Sorsea. <laughs> Cynthia is the Community and Schools Coordinator for the West Virginia Department of Education. We have Erin Boyd. <laughs> she is a Community and Schools Regional Representative for the West Virginia Department of Education. We have Vicki Shannon. Office of the First Lady. We have Serena Nichols, Office of the First Lady. On this side, we have Mrs. Deirdre Klein, Superintendent of Wyoming County Schools. We have Alan Stiltner, President of Wyoming County Board of Education. Richie Walker, Vice President of Wyoming County Board of Education. Mike Pritchard, Member of Wyoming County Board of Education. Doug Kennedy, Member of Wyoming County Board of Education. Kara Hossie Mitchell, Assistant Superintendent. John Henry, Assistant Superintendent. Roger Snow, Magistrate. Michael Cochran, Judge. Josie Peters, Judge's Clerk. Josh Miller, Assistant Prosecutor. Derek Laxton, Assistant Prosecutor. Greg Bishop, Prosecutor. 
Paula Laporta, Executive Secretary, Biden County Board of Education. Kim Saibo Runyon, Director of Of Student Services and Attendance at the Wyoming County Board of Education. Keith Stewart, Director of the Wyoming County Board of Education. Brenda Shumay, Director of Special Services, Wyoming County Board of Education. And we also have Zach Hellman Dollar, Chief of Police. I'm glad you did give uh, Keith Hellman Dollar a special shout out because he helps us a lot. He is keeping a watchful eye on us. Where is he? We're so glad he's here watching over us every day. How did we all come to be gathered here today? Because this is a huge celebration. This is a very big deal. This day has been in the making for a very long time, and I've heard a little bit of history that went into getting us where we are today, to this event. This gift that we are about to receive began as a dream. It began as a dream by some teachers and other staff members. And yesterday I heard the story that Mrs. Rebecca Farley told about getting dressed up. She said a bunch of us got dressed up and we went to Charleston. We went to the governor's office and she said, and we told them what we wanted. And guess what? Pineville Elementary got chosen to receive a wonderful gift. It's a phenomenal gift that's really an honor beyond words. You are very fortunate, boys and girls, students. You are very fortunate to, to receive this gift. And I'm so glad that those teachers, because you have phenomenal teachers and phenomenal educators in this building and lots of staff members, and they do have dreams, and they wanted to make this school even better for you. So I want you to think, as students, what are some of your dreams? And I want you to see from today that when you dream, that dream can become a reality. You have to have a lot of hard work. You have to be at school. But you can make your dreams. You know that saying, you can make your dreams come true? It is really true, and you're going to see it today. The honored and distinguished guests we have here today are guests. You see these people on each side of me? Well, they're guests. They're not usually here, are they? They're not usually here. A guest is somebody that comes and visits and then they leave. But the, the guest that you're going to have for the gift, he's not going to leave. And I won't even call him a guest. In my world, I call him a person. Because that person becomes a part of the family. And this phenomenal gift is going to be a part of your family here at Pablo Elementary School. And his name is River. Can you say that? And let me make sure you understand. He is going to be here every day. He is becoming a part of our family. He is going to be my friend and your friend. He's going to be everybody's friend. But I want you to remember, he's also a worker. He's a worker just like Miss Keeper and just like all the other staff members. River will be here every day that you come to school. Unless we might have to have a sick day occasionally. But let's hope not. So when Miss Keeper says every day, I mean every day. So that's our hope. That's our goal. So he may be at the front of the school at the entrance. You know how some of you get dropped off for school? 
He may be out there waiting for you to get here. He may be there to greet you in the mornings. He may be where you get picked up to tell you goodbye. He may be sometimes at the bus loading area to tell you good morning or to tell you goodbye at the end of the day and that he'll see you back at school tomorrow. But you've got to get here to school if you're going to see him. River is not going to miss school because we all know if you miss school, you're missing out. You guys know that. Some of the other things that River's going to be here to do, he's going to be here for you and me and any of the other staff members if we're having a bad day. You know how some days are just not very good? And some days you need somebody to talk to or somebody to hug. He's going to be here for us for that. He may be a friend that you read to or that you explain how to do a math problem to. He may be a friend that you play with at recess because you know how we all love exercise. River's going to need exercise too. And he wants to have fun as well. He may be visiting your classrooms, checking on you to see if you're here at school and see if you are learning. He'll be in the hallways and he'll be watching and seeing if we're all following directions. Now the staff and I tried to keep this a secret, but I don't know if we did a very good job of that. But you are going to know when you see River how special he is, and I know you're going to be surprised. And we are going to welcome him as our newest member to our Pablo Elementary family. Can we all join the Wyoming East cheerleaders in the River chant?
get off your bus or out of your mom or dad's car or truck and see rivers standing on the sidewalks. I see lots of friends that, that, I, that are in Wyoming County that I know, that I've known for years. Uh, a lot of people were down here quite often and I just love the area. They're special to us. We want you just to know that kids, you all can do anything in what you want to do. You can be what you want to do. So you all just remember that, okay? Well, I want to tell you that River is going to be here. And River wants you all to come to school. I know that sometimes you all can't come to school because of different things going on or circumstances. But River's going to be here every day. And like Ms. Keeper said, you can't learn if you don't come to school. So let's try to come to school every day to see River, to talk to him, to read to him, to let him be your freedom. Again, thank you all for letting me be here. Thank you, First Lady Justice. At this time, I would like to invite Mrs. Deirdre Klein, Superintendent of Wyoming County Schools, to speak to you about this monumental day and what I would like to call Our Boy River. Thank you, Ms. Keeper. I'm so excited to be with you today and I get to do a presentation that will help us always honor River. I am so excited for you all that you get to have River with you every day. But I'm also excited for River because he is coming to a school that will not only take care of him, but that will love and appreciate him. He's one lucky dog, absolutely. I want to thank the Pima Elementary School students and staff for creating such a loving, caring, nurturing school for children and for going after this dream. You made it happen. I want to thank Ms. Kiefer for this day and moving forward. If you all don't know, Ms. Kiefer loves dogs. And so that is going to be a foundation of Pima Elementary School. The handlers team that Ms. Kiefer introduced, everybody at Pine Elementary that works with you, your teachers, your cooks, your custodians, your aides, everybody, your bus drivers, everybody that works at Pine Elementary School is very, very special. But to offer River a home, even in the nighttime, is a wonderful thing. Thank you, Team River. First Lady Justice, as Ms. Kiefer said, we are so grateful to have you with us today. And, and everybody at Pine Elementary School, I want you to look at First Lady Justice right now. Look at her, give her eyes. And I want you to know that you are looking at a woman who is our First Lady, who does everything she can to make life good for children and to help you come to school and learn and be happy when you get here. I want you to clap real big for First Lady Justice. Thank you to Wyoming East for your support today, Ms. Walker and the cheer team, Mr. Dobson and the band. We appreciate you and we're glad you're with us today. It is my honor as superintendent of Wyoming County Schools, it is my honor and pleasure on behalf of the Wyoming County Board of Education and the Pine Boy Elementary School to declare that today, September the 14th, will from this day forward and forever be known as Rivers Gotcha Day. This is a plaque for you all and for River. And River's gonna be here every day for a long, long time. And hopefully this will hang in the hallway and you will always remember this big deal 
real special day at your school. We got you, River. Thank you, Mrs. Claude. And this poster, we already have a spot picked out, and you need to look for it. It'll be outside in the hallway in the display case. So at this time, I think, under the direction of Mr. Sam Dobson, I think it's time to hear the Wyoming Spike song.
features, we've had just a little bit of a change in the way we normally dismiss. Preschool, we want you to start over here, and you're going to go around that way, and there's going to be a little special treat waiting for you over here at the River Bulletin Board. Then, of course, kindergarten, you can go and file in line behind the preschool.